Perry Edwards and Alex Oxlade Chamberlain have been burgled at their £3. 5 million home on an exclusive road in Cheshire. The couple were downstairs with their son Axel when thieves ransacked the home and made off with a number of expensive items, including designer handbags and jewellery. They called the police but sources say the raid has left them terrified and heartbroken, according to The Sun. CCTV is now being examined by detectives in the hopes of tracking down the culprit. A friend told The Sun, it's just the most violating thing, to think that someone has been all over their belongings before they even realized what was happening is so upsetting. The brazenness of doing it while they were in the house is terrifying, and obviously they're heartbroken that a lot of valuable items which meant a great deal to them, not just financially, have been taken. This is their dream home and they love their life there as a family. Suddenly it feels tarnished, but they're determined to get on with their lives and obviously they'll take every necessary step to ensure they are totally secure in the future. Cheshire Police confirmed that its officers had been called to the property at 10.45 p.m. on Tuesday night. They said, the offenders have broken into the home stealing jewellery and handbags while the occupants were inside. The couple, both 29, had their son Axel in August 2021 and bought the house in cash the year before. Former Manchester United boss Sir Alex Ferguson and Manchester City goalie Ederson are among their neighbours. A neighbour said, this latest break-in is a real worry. This is a very quiet street and lots of residents have very good security, so it is quite frightening these thugs still feel comfortable enough to break in, especially when people are in. It must have been terrifying. In May, fellow Liverpool player and neighbour Andy Robertson increased security around his own home after a prowler sparked a significant security breach while he was away playing for Scotland. A man was later arrested in connection with the incident, 